Good morning. No, not yet. Yes. Um, so it is one mile. Oh, one point three miles. So yeah, getting lost. Like, sorry. Direction. Four a.m. Um, it. Okay. Yeah. It is four a.m. right now on Friday, October eighth. No, it's well. You just get in the left lane. It's the left. Yeah. Sure? Yeah, positive. Hold on, we get we'll wait. Back. Okay, back on track. Yeah, we just needed a little something with the direction. So you were about to hit an 18 wheel. Yes. <laughs> so basically, um, if you've been following along at all, um, me and Isabella are sorry, Isabella and I are trying to go to all 50 states. So back in February, we went to Cleveland, and that was so fun. It was just so random. Yeah, and basically, so how we pick the state is we kind of just look at, like, the flights that are, like, the cheapest at the time, and states like Arkansas and, like, Ohio that we went to are states that you could use, like, only really have to go for, like, four or five days, like, that's why we've been going, and we're saving, like, the cooler ones for, like, a week or more than a week. So, right now, it's currently 4 a.m., like I just showed you, and we're on our way to the airport, and we fly out for Arkansas this morning. <laughs> it was just, like, so random. Also, just found out that Arkansas is a different time zone than New York. I don't even know. know where it was. Yeah. And yesterday, okay, we've had this flight booked for a few months, but yesterday, we finally we're to get texting each other, asking where it is on the map. So... I don't know. Also, one more thing. One more thing. We just found out the weather in Arkansas. I don't know if we're just like dumb. You're ready to wear like sweaters. Yeah, I was I was ready for just like fall weather. But I go on the weather app and it's 91 this whole weekend in October. So I don't really know. But so we're about bathing suits. Yeah, so my mom had to come bring me bathing suits to college. I needed jean shorts, tank tops. I didn't bring one pair of sweatpants. I'm literally boarding the plane in shorts. Like, I don't know what I'm doing, yeah, but... Like yeah. So, I mean, it'll be definitely nice. I'm glad it's not snowing, but just yeah. wasn't expecting 91 degree weather, I guess, so... It was, like, fun to be cold in Ohio, though, so at yeah. least this time will be opposite. Yeah. But, alright, well, we'll see you guys at the airport. We're, like, five minutes away, so... through security mm -hmm. and now we are just waiting to board so there wasn't the starbucks line literally wrapped around the whole entire air the starbucks line wrapped around the whole entire airport so now we are just isabelle's eating beef jerky for yeah, breakfast so Oh my gosh, we made it to Arkansas and people can definitely tell that we're not from here because we're sitting outside in bathing suits already. Yeah. But uh, we got to our Airbnb and we'll do a little um, like tour after. But me and Isabella basically just settled in. We Ubered from the airport to our Airbnb and it's so cute. This is the, so we're, it's like a guest house. Yeah. So that's like the owner, like his house, which ours is like, is like a mini version. yeah. And ours is just like a mini version. But that's like literally all you need. Like it's just the two of us. Yeah. So last time was like today. Yeah, and last time when we went to Ohio, like I said back in February, like it was a three bedroom. Like it was just unnecessary. Yeah. So we, we just door dashed sushi because we Instacarted just some like snacks and like groceries to have while we're here for a few days. And so we were like couldn't leave or anything, and we wanted we want to go out to dinner. So we were like let's just order food. So yeah, we got some lunch. These are the crab ragoons. <laughs> Yum. At Danielle. These are look so good. Oh yeah, and also like I'll show you. This is like our little patio. So Isabella's on that. So this is like our own backyard. So it's like a little patio, a fireplace, which is so cute. And then we're like across from the school, but yeah, it's like literally so cute and it's so nice out. So I'm like so excited to be here. But we'll show you the rest of the sushi. This is your Arkansas roll. That's one roll. 
I don't know if the sushi is like good in Arkansas, but we <laughs> said we'll try it. Okay. This is what happens when you get sushi off DoorDash. And this is the other one. Oh, this is your other one. Did you get crazy? Yum. That one's my capital. Oh, this is your other one that looks good, actually. Yum. All right. Well, we're going to eat lunch, so we'll talk to you later. Bye. Okay. Welcome back to the vlog. So, Isabella and I, basically, after sushi, we just came inside and we kind of just napped for, like, two hours just because our flight, like we showed you, was so early and... We just like needed a little break or we would have not been able to do anything tonight. So we just napped and then we just woke up, well, like an two hour. hours, yeah, an hour ago. And we just got ready and we're just gonna go to like this rooftop like restaurant, which is gonna be like super cool. And they just have like pizzas and like appetizers and stuff. And so we're just gonna just go there and see what it's like because the Airbnb owner told us it's super cool. And so we're gonna just Uber there since we don't have a car. And yeah, so yeah. don't mind our messy Airbnb since it's so small. I'll show you guys tomorrow. Um, everything's kind of everywhere, but <laughs> yeah, I'll show you the rooftop. Good morning. So, um, right now, um, like I said before, the book that the Airbnb guy left us that has, like, um, breakfast and, like, top food places to go eat at, um, <coughs> has one breakfast place, and it's only a 10-minute walk from our Airbnb, and it's obviously so nice out, and it's really nice because it's, like, you walk through, like, a normal neighborhood, like, very, like, safe and stuff, but, so, we're gonna be there in, like, one minute, and it's called the Root Casa. Yeah. The root cafe, and yeah, we're gonna go. Like, yeah. Also, Isabella and I, like, I don't know what's wrong with us, but we forgot sunglasses on this trip, but remembered bathing suits. I don't know, but so we had to we had to prime these to the Airbnb, yeah, like house. So that's good, but yeah, we're walking right now. Little morning stroll. Yep. So, see you at breakfast. Oh, tell them what happened. Oh. Last night, forgot to vlog this part. Last night, um, we are leaving like that rooftop place that we were at, and they have like a bunch of scooters here for like people that don't have cars and, and stuff. And yeah, and you just like literally, if you see one on the street, you just download the app, scan the QR code, and like it lets you like rent the scooter, and it's like thirty-five cents a minute or something. So they're like really cheap. And so me and Isabella were like, we don't have these at home. Like, let's ride them. But like I'm not even being dramatic. Like they literally go so fast. 30 like miles per hour. 30 miles an hour. I googled it this morning. Like so fast. And that's like that's pretty 30 fast on a scooter. Yeah. And so it's not that I wasn't expecting well, I wasn't expecting the speed. But the sidewalks, I don't know if you can tell, but they're literally all like this. Like dips the in the road. And you fly. Yeah, so there's like a little lever for the speed and you like press it all the way down. And you literally, Isabella was like, oh my God, like there's a curb. Like she was like, oh, like I almost just went over this curb. And I was like, it's hard to look straight, look down at the curb. So I was like, all right. And we were so, directions on our phone. Yeah. And we were trying to Google maps how to get home. Cause you, you can ride them home. Just leave them in front of your house. We're going right. And so I go over a curb. I, like I flew over a curb basically in 250 and feet I take a left just yeah i cut open both hands like actually like i'm not i know it doesn't look bad but it actually really hurts and cut open my elbow and pulled her my down. other elbow and i think my quads actually pulled like it hurts so bad like i'm yeah i'm just unwell so i told Isabella, I was like i'm sorry it would have been so fun to ride them to breakfast but we're just not like it's got a refund for it since oh yeah and then you can like report on the app if you got in like an accident or like what because we only went one block one one block <laughs> so i reported that i got hurt and then i woke up to an email saying like i've been refunded but it's not even about the money it said i'm injured so <laughs> uh, right over bye
Welcome back. <laughs> Welcome back to our vlog. Um, so where'd we leave off? Oh, breakfast. So after breakfast, we walked back home. Or no, we walked to like this cute little shop place. Um, because when we got breakfast, they were like on like a cute little street of shops yeah. and like random boutiques and stuff. But so we walked and I got this cool sweatshirt. Well, it's just tan oversized and it says Little Rock. Yeah. Anyway, so I got that sweatshirt at a store and look at her folding it. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> um, and then right now we are actually waiting for an Uber. So we figured we would vlog. We are going axe throwing because um, our air, I think I already said this, but um, the Airbnb owner that we're staying at, he like gave us like a bunch of free hours, uh, like a free hour of axe throwing. And it's like really close to where we're staying. So we were like, that's kind of fun to just do that. Because tonight we're going on a sunset kayak tour. And it's like a two hour tour in a kayak. And it takes you on the Arkansas River, which is really cool. Wait, and so we were like, Mississippi? yeah, I guess the Arkansas River and the Mississippi River are the same thing someone told us. Would they call it the Arkansas River? I don't know. Because we're in Arkansas. I don't know. But anyway. So we wanted to kill time before the sunset tour. So we were like, let's just go throw axes. That's kind of fun. And I've never done that before. So now we are waiting for our Uber, but yeah, it should be fun. Welcome back to our vlog. I don't even know when the last time I vlogged was, but anyway, um, basically <clears throat> yesterday we, or in the vlog, you saw that we went on the sunset kayak thing. And then after that, um, I had like a really bad like ear infection come on randomly. So we kind of just stayed in and watched a movie last night and DoorDash <laughs> bad food. Like it was a sub and it was disgusting, but anyway, it's okay. So we woke up and we just got ready and our Uber driver is on its way. And I'm actually having them stop at like a pharmacy, like CVS, to get ear infection medicine because it was so bad that I couldn't even do anything last night. And then we are going to go to a brewery. Also, mission of the day, we're trying to find the welcome to Arkansas sign. Yeah. Because we want to like take a picture in front of all the signs when we go to all the states. So wish us luck on that. There should be a lot. There's a lot in New York. They're like, yeah, they're like every exit, I feel. <laughs> okay. Maybe I'll... Um, so wow. after the brewery place, we just came back or we were at the brewery for kind of a long time. Yeah, like two hours. Yeah. But after the brewery place, we just came back and we just hung out and then we were really in the mood for something sweet just because I think that we ate like salty all day. Mm -hmm. So we just door dashed ice cream from like a creamery place that's like supposed to be like famous in Little Rock. <coughs> it was really good. And then we just napped and now we are going to... Where are we going to dinner? Some Hi taco place. Yeah, some taco place that someone at the brewery told us to go to. So we're going to get tacos for dinner. And then we might go to this cocktail bar and grill thing. And um, our Airbnb owner said that it's, like, really cool for drinks if you go on, like, the second floor. Yeah. So that'll be cool. And then, if anything, we both said that we were down to, like, go to the rooftop bar again. Oh, yeah. Which would be fun because that was fun the other night. Mm -hmm. So... 
<laughs> so outfit of the day is well come back for an outfit check um my shirt is from Shein bralette don't know jeans are from Zara and shoes are from I don't know shoes are from Target jeans are from American Eagle mm -hmm. Shein Brandy's necklaces oh yeah and my necklaces are from Express so we are going to dinner oh we're going to dinner <laughs> so see you there So we just walked across like a long pedestrian bridge, which was actually so cool. It's a little windy today, but um, the first place that we went to eat, we wanted to go to breakfast, but um, the breakfast place that we had, our Uber dropped us off at, he was like, you guys shouldn't go here. Cause he was like, there's yeah, there's like so many other better breakfast places. And the place he dropped us off at, he thought was gonna be breakfast, but it wasn't. They ended breakfast by the time we got there. But it's okay, we got lunch, and now we are just walking in like downtown Little Rock, and there's like shops and food places and stuff, so. And I know that so I just we just went in this cute little cafe and I just got a vanilla cold brew. And now we're on the swing. Look how cute. They have like this whole like city area. But this is literally like a swing. Mm-hmm. And I know you would say I gave up way too soon. Mm-hmm. Hello, Arkansas. <laughs> Fuck Arkansas, honestly. <laughs> bleep, bleep, bleep. <laughs> um, so we just got ready and we went to like this place that a lot of people have been telling us to go to. It was called Threefold and it was like very, very authentic like Chinese food. It was but glass. <laughs> it was like noodle and dumpling bowls. So we got a dumpling bowl and it was honestly just like I don't know, a certain amount of dumplings with like the sauce on it. And it was so good. Like yeah, really, really good. good. And so now we are walking to like this place that um it's called Capital Bar. And it's like um like you can sit up outside, I guess, upstairs, like on the second floor. So I maybe like a rooftop, I'm not really sure. Um, and you just sit down and get like cocktails and stuff. So yeah. yeah. Skip to the good part. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, we're at this little rooftop bar and look how cute. Not rooftop bar, but little lounge. And it's so cute. 
Also, this drink I got is so good. Like, so good. Hey, guys. So, we just got back from dinner. And then that little, like, rooftop. Not really rooftop, but, like, second floor, like, lounge thing that was in that cool hotel. And we decided to come home, like, a little. Not early, but. Earlier than planned. Earlier than planned, yeah. Because our flight kind of leaves early. Well, it leaves at 10 tomorrow. So, we have to, like, board by, like, 9.20. So, we just have to make it to the airport on time. And so we just wanted to come home and pack up our stuff because it's our last night here in Little Rock. But I think in the beginning of the vlog, I showed this. The Airbnb guy left um, this book. And what you're supposed to write is like your favorite place to travel. So ever, anyone that has ever stayed in his Airbnb has like wrote their favorite place to travel. And then it's like literally pages and pages of like different people and like where they where their favorite place to travel was and why which i think is like so cool sitting here isabella and i were just like reading them because obviously we're trying to go to all 50 states so it's cool to see like where people wanted to travel and why so i just wanted to read what me and isabella wrote so we could remember this so on our page someone else wrote above us she said her favorite place to travel was all the national parks she went to the Grand Canyon. She went to Bryce Canyon National Forest. She said she loved the beautiful state of Arkansas. And ours is below hers. So, we said, <laughs> our favorite place to travel so far was Cleveland, Ohio. Weirdly enough, it was the first city we have ever traveled to together and it was so fun and random. Arkansas was next on our list and staying at the layover, that's what this Airbnb is called, made it 10 times better. Thank you so much for the hospitality at the such cute place. We made great memories here and would definitely stay again when we come to Little Rock. Till next time, Brandy and Isabella, the New York girls. Because everyone's writing with- Whoa! <laughs> oh my god, we got a little artist, Pablo Picasso on our hands. But yeah, so I thought that was so cute and a really, really good idea. Because it just makes you- Appreciate. Yeah, appreciate life and- like you can learn about new places to travel <laughs> but also one more thing before i end the vlog for tonight um he left us like this notepad oh my gosh like when we got here and it was just like welcome like let me know if you need anything so basically like in this little book he introduced him and his son because him and his son are, like live at the house the bigger house that's next door and um so we wrote him like a little note just saying thank you for letting us stay here which was so cute and i said thank you so much until we meet again which is cute oh my gosh i don't even think oh <gasps> i don't think i ever showed the airbnb <laughs> you didn't Are you okay <laughs> yeah i'm still recording send this to him after when you finish the vlog yeah okay well once isabella's done packing because she's packing up her stuff for tomorrow because we just tried to repack our suitcase this is mine i will show you guys the airbnb quick just so you can get a feel of where we've been staying for the past four days i'm so sorry i think i i you've definitely seen parts but not the whole thing but let her finish packing and then i'll show you okay so after you walk in this is the kitchen spot which is just so perfect and our airbnb guy was so nice enough to give us like K-cups, snacks, and like sugars and stuff. And then this was just the bed area, Isabella. <laughs> um, a big body mirror, which is always nice. And then just a desk, TV, nightstands. And then our bathroom, which is so nice. And I love this, but yeah. Also so funny, he had a little our guest room poop book and you were supposed to write when you were taking a poop and you're supposed to draw a picture of what they looked like so <laughs> that's so funny but and then just a huge mirror and then our shower so yeah honestly it's like a studio little apartment but for just Isabella and I it's so cute and literally all you need Okay, so right now we're just gonna finish packing, cleaning up the Airbnb a little bit, and then we will probably just watch a movie and go to bed. Isabella's out here taking cough medicine. <laughs> but other than that, we will see you in the morning for our flight home. Yep. So sad, but all right, peace out.